Welcome to my birthday set, Ranakhat, West Bengal, India. Let us observe this totally unedited surgery. This is a posterior subcapsular cataract. The nucleus is very soft. In such cases, the nucleus sustainer is not required to bridge off the nucleus. By this time, the main incision has been made and this is a side port on the left side of the main incision about 3 clock hours away. Now capsulorexis is being done with the uterita forceps. I am using the studio coaxial illumination. The microscope is Lumera T from Jais. Hydrodissection is done. And now the nucleus is tapped. Inject some visco and take the pre chopper and the nucleus sustainer, and the pre chopper goes easily with the help of without the help of the sustainer. It is so soft. But this pre chop will not help because we cannot separate the pieces with the nucleus is very soft. We have to do something else. So what I am planning is I am going to rotate this nuclear mass rosatily spin not so many times as Dr. Rosatily does and now I am trying to do the carousel technique, but this carousel technique also failed in this case. And now I am trying to pull the nucleus and trying to prolapse it out of the bag, trying to hold the periphery of the nucleus and I could hold once after two, three attempts and the nucleus sustainer goes behind the nuclear mass and in no time we can manage such cases. And now see this, this is a removal of cortex by the handpiece itself. I am using 400 vacuum and 40 fluorite to do this. And I am trying to remove some uh, uh, lens matter that is sticking to the posterior capsule and it, it partially. So, cortex is removed by the handpiece itself. There is some cortex sticking to the posterior capsule here and there. So, what I am planning is I will do hydro polish. I have taken the irrigating probe of bimanual IA and the irrigating jet is directed towards those cells and the, the irrigating jet is swept from side, side to side and those cells that sticks to the posterior capsule gets dislodged easily. This is a hydrophobic monofocal intraocular lens and the lens has gone in the capsular bag. One haptic of the uh, lens was stuck with the optic, it has got released by this time and now this is a bit of moxie and now I close the side port by hydro, corneal stromal hydration and a final lavage is done. I do this final lavage to decrease the incidences of TAS. Some portion of the moxie that I have used comes out but whatever remains that works well in my cases. And now the antichamber is formed by the 23G Simcoe and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. Be a great surgeon and serve your patients with love, respect, empathy and great surgical competence.